days after the devastating three-way train accident in Odisha, which claimed the lives of 275 passengers and left more than 900 injured, the Indian Railways has decided to secure the Gumtis that house signalling equipment on railway station premises with a double-lock arrangement. India and the US on Monday concluded a roadmap for defence industrial cooperation which shall guide the policy direction for the next few years towards cooperation in high technology areas and identifying opportunities for co-development and co-production. Services sector output grew at the second fastest pace in 13 years in May as per the S&P Global India Services PMI Business Activity Index, which eased to 61.2 from 62 in April. The world's largest grouping of crude oil producers, commonly known as OPEC+, Plus, agreed on Sunday to extend ongoing production cuts into 2024 as it seeks to keep oil prices from falling amid concerns about a global economic slowdown. Mired in a slowing economy, inflationary setting and tighter monetary controls world over, India's merchandise exports shrunk 12.7% on a year-on-year, Yovai, basis to $34.66 billion in April, a six-month low. Imports fell sharper by 14% to $49.90 billion during the same period. The head of the International Energy Agency, IEA, on Monday said that the chance of higher oil prices had increased sharply after a new pact between producers to limit supply.